was popping you are it's your girl Amani Sharifa what's up what's popping what's pop 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 yo who's popping <laughs> shout out to all my people that is tuning <laughs> Back into your go channel. What's up, mama, papas? So, on to this episode, we are going to be talking all about, you know, as being a light worker, you are really expected, my loves, to be humble and to be of service above everything, babies. So, I'm going to be giving you all just some really motivating words that can really help you out if you are a light worker. So let's go ahead. We're gonna hop right on into it. Let's get it. Ew. <laughs> Hi, right, Chua. Thank you again for tuning back into your girl channel. What's up? What's motherfucking good? Yeah. <laughs> What's poppin', babies? What's good, you all? What's up? What's up? <laughs> so, on to this episode. Like I said, babies, we are going to be talking about, you know, a really 100 topic, really for my light workers out here, babies. So, if you are a light worker, baby girls, fellas, this episode is specifically for you, baby. And what we're going to be really rapping today about is all about, you know, being a light worker my loves you know the expectations is definitely for you babies to always be of service and to be very humble oh oh yeah <laughs> so for you all that you know if you let's say you don't even know what a light worker is but you do you know fit what i'm about to describe light workers as i'm just gonna give you all like a quick little definition so essentially you know a light worker is someone that pretty much sheds light for the greater good of humanity you know what i'm saying and whatever kind of way that means for you essentially my loves you are doing something in your life that is for the overall greater good of the planet you know what i'm saying and that could translate in so many different areas of life so whatever area you ain't saying that it is for you babies you are really feeling very called very pulled by a law god the universe the lord the holy spirit the divine the most high whatever name mama papa that you want to call God and <laughs> find me loves because God got multiple names. You ain't shame, but you are really, really feeling like that energetic pull from a Lord go the universe to be of service to others. <laughs> so again, babies, that could mean so many different areas of life. Maybe you are being of service to actual humanity, like people. Maybe you're being of service to just the environment. You know, Mother Nature. Maybe you're being of service to animals. You know what I'm saying? There's so many different walks of life, babies, that, you know, as light workers, you can be of service to. You know? But the main thing is that you are walking in that higher light, Mama, Papa. You're walking in that higher vibrational energy to be that guiding light in the darkness. Oh, Oh, yeah. <laughs> so what I really, really just wanted to like really break down today is some really great motivational words, babies, to make sure that as you being a light worker, mama, papa, you are staying very connected to the mission. You ain't saying like the motherfucking mission that you're on, my loves, because sometimes some people that you know are light workers not all light workers you know but just some people can kind of get into the habit when a lord of the universe is really blessing them and all different kind of areas of their life or you know really blessing them and whatever kind of walk of the mission that they're on they start to lose sight of being of service and then they start to like really adopt a personality where 
they kind of become a little arrogant and the mission and it's it's kind of stemming from like a place of they feel like wow you know i'm accomplishing this i i'm accomplishing that so you know i'm this i'm that i'm this i'm that and that's where growth fellas <laughs> what i really want to talk about babies because you have to always keep that motherfucker shit in perspective you know what i'm saying like any power my loves that a logo the universe blesses you what any type of accomplishments that he bless you with in your life or just when you walk on your mission that you're on as a lay worker understand babies listen to me here follow me understand that that is the most high that is the lord the holy spirit along with the universe working through you ain't she i'm gonna say that shit one more time mama papa that is along with the universe working through through you my loves so it's very important to understand that humility being humble and your service and being humble just on your path of being a light worker is very empowered <laughs> it's very very empowered baby because it keeps you firmly rooted and what a lot of the universe is blessing you to do in your life and just being on that mission as a light worker you know it's not to say that oh when you're a light worker you should be you know really insecure you shouldn't be confident or anything hell motherfucking no <laughs> like if it's one thing that i consistently put out on my channel you should always be motherfucking confident my girl my dude and anything you do you ain't saying like i don't give a damn what you're doing in life you should always be be represent confidence you know what i'm saying because a logo the universe the lord the holy spirit the divine the most high my mom papa we serve a confident god my girl my dude our god is not insecure at all <laughs> not at all because he created everything up in this bitch oh <laughs> Period. Everything that we see and that we don't see, he has created babies. So in no way, shape, or form am I telling you that, oh, you should be ancient, unconfident, oh, you should never be, you know, proud of yourself, oh, you should never, you ain't you know, pat yourself on the back, and hell no. <laughs> Let me make myself real clear. That's not what I'm saying at all, baby. All I'm saying is that you always want to be humble. You know what I'm saying? Definitely display confidence. You always want to be, you know, proud of yourself by the grace of a logo of the universe for anything that he has blushed you to accomplish on your mission as being a light worker. But keep in mind what I just said. He blushed you to accomplish that. You know what I'm saying? He blushed you to accomplish it. So you have to still, always as a light worker, keep that humility and giving him the praise and thanking him for blessing you to accomplish whatever it is, mama, papa, that you are accomplishing on your path as being a light worker. Because when you do that, baby, that's showing the universe that you are raising your vibration higher and higher because you are understanding that you didn't just accomplish you ain't saying what the fuck you accomplished just because of you you are understanding that it's a higher power mama papa that is working through you that blessed you and gave you the will power will power <laughs> and gave you the strength and the encouragement to get whatever the fuck it was done you know what I'm saying? That's straight facts. No cap but my rap, my girl, my dude. So that's why it's very important to understand that, you know, always give a log of the universe the most high the praise, baby. Nothing wrong with being confident. Ain't shit wrong with that. I always say on my channel, you are, you know, confidence and cockiness. That is two different things, my loves. That's two different things. A lot of good universe want us to be confident, babies. 
because that represents our strength that represents you know our willpower to know that he's going to bless us to do whatever the fuck it is that you ain't saying we try to get done you know but it's a difference when you are being cocky you know when you're being when you see a motherfucker out here cocky as hell those are people that are very arrogant that you know they don't they think that everything revolves about them and they think that shit motherfucking sun rise and sets on their ass they think that any kind of success any kind of accolades any kind of accomplishments that they have done in their life they think it was just them that did it they don't understand that now nah, motherfucker it wasn't just you you know what i'm saying like it was a long go to universe so you gotta give credit but it's all big to work you know what I'm saying? So it's only right that you always give your father my loves because that is your father. You came from him, baby. Especially if you a light worker because you're walking in his higher light. It's always important to keep that shit in perspective and understand that he is the reason that you know you're on that light working path. He is the reason why you know by the grace of him. You're able to accomplish whatever it is in your mission and your service. You know, it's not just you, baby. So, always keep that perspective, my loves. You know, be confident, of course. Because that's what a logo the universe represent, my girl, my doll. Confidence, mama, papa. But be humble at the same time. Be very humble. And when you keep that type of humility kind of attitude, but yet you still motherfucking confident, you ain't saying because you know who the fuck you are at the end of the day, baby girls, fellas. When you have that type of well balance where you're confident, but you're very humble at the same time, then you, you stay connected, my loves, more to the service of the mission that, you know, the most higher log of the universe has you on. As being a light worker. When you see motherfuckers out here. That get really big hearted. And they really start to feel like that. You know they're the reason as a light worker. They could do this. So they're the reason like this. As a light worker they could do that. You know. They start to become disconnected from the mission. Because a true light worker. Is always going to give praise. To a log of the universe. The Lord the Holy Spirit. The divine the most high. And always yes. Going to be very confident in themselves. And you know like celebrate their accomplishments but at the same time they're always my mom papa going to remain real motherfucking humble because they never get that shit fucked up to think that it's all of them they know that it's the universe that is blessing them so that's the difference babies and you always want to be that kind of light worker where you are being very humble you know, so that way you can never get disconnected from your life service mission, baby. When you have all that motherfucking arrogance and cockiness and who oh, is me and you, 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 you. <laughs> Like, girl, fellas, when you have that type of energy, baby, you know what type of energy? That what be that? You want to know, baby? Satan's ass motherfucker energy. And I'm sorry. That's the truth. <laughs> that represents Satan's ass energy. Because Satan always wants you to be motherfucking cocky as hell. He always wants you to be arrogant. He always wants you to be mad motherfucking boastful. He always wants you to feel like that. It was never a log of the universe that really helped you. A higher power. You know, that helped you, but it was just you and only you. You know, he always wants you, my loves, to be very full of yourself. He never wants you to, for well, for well, give the praise and the things, you know, to a longer the universe. He never wants you to motherfucking do that. He always wants you to feel like it's just you. And at the end of the day, no, it's not just you. Because if a longer the universe was not to have given your ass, ear, and your lungs, and blessed you to wake the fuck fuck up you you wouldn't even be on the light work of mission at all you know what i'm saying so you know you have to just really keep that in perspective because again that cocky arrogant ass motherfucker energy babies 
and this on some well ass shit like this ain't no no oh you know says you spooky da, da, da. hell no i ain't motherfucking spooky i'm speaking facts baby you know what i'm saying like this some well ass shit that cockiness that that arrogance that boastful ass attitude where uh, you think it's all you and you never give him please to the more side for well for well i really not just giving him please but actually meaning that in your own life by how you just you know like conduct things in your own life when you are representing the opposite of that and you're just being you know like i said boastful that cocky arrogant attitude because you feel like that you can have that kind of attitude because maybe as a light worker and whatever field that you're in you're being very blessed to be successful by the beast of a lord of the universe you know so feeling like that is all you and being boastful and cocky and arrogant that really represents not a lord of the universe energy but satan's motherfucker energy you know because it's a lower vibrational energy mama papa and that is connected to satan at the end of the day i ain't saying like i'm just keeping it a being with you you know mama papa so at the end of the day always as a light worker walking that more higher vibrational light of being humble you know nothing wrong with being confident you damn sure gotta be that you know what i'm saying because that confidence is gonna add more strength it's gonna add more motherfucking fuel to the fire <laughs> <laughs> it's going to add more fuel to your fire you know what i'm saying but you have to always keep on perspective you know that it is a logo the universe at the end of the day that is blessing you my loves to be on that path to be of service and your light working mission so i hope this helps babies <laughs> i hope this hope this hope this helps babies and no way shape type of form my loves am i saying that you know as a light worker oh you gotta be motherfucking perfect you ain't saying you could never make a mistake because you a light worker you're supposed to be shedding light hell motherfucking no <laughs> because you already know baby like if you turn into my channel you know one of my main facts of life um, you already know what i'm about to say nobody is perfect mama papa other than a log of the universe and he don't expect for us to be perfect at the end of the day baby what he expects is for us to be very genuine when we do have a relationship with him and ourselves to be very consistent with our relationship with him and ourselves and to strive for excellence you know what I'm saying? in all areas of our lives and naturally when we do that baby that's how we do grow that's how we do change that's how we do elevate that's how you know we just become a better version of ourselves but it happens over time mama papa you know like it don't happen overnight my loves you know it does happen over time so in no way am i saying that oh as a light worker ain't saying your motherfucking ass gotta be perfect and if you ain't perfect shit fuck you you ain't a light worker <laughs> like girl fellas hell no i ain't saying that because <laughs> nobody's perfect i'm not perfect you not perfect ain't none of us perfect other than this bitch you ain't shame, but what I am saying, my loves, is definitely hold yourself accountable to make sure that, you know, you're blessed at the end of the day. You're very blessed if you are a light worker. That means that a of the universe, my mom, papa, he's seen something very special in you. You know, he's seen something very special in you to trust you with more of his power to have the ability to share light and some kind of way on the planet and be of an impact to others in some kind of way not everybody got that motherfucking ability and i'm sorry that's the truth he ain't saying like god favors who he pleases you know what i'm saying like he chooses who he pleases the most high the universe the lord the holy spirit the lord god he he favors who he pleases you know what i'm saying but when he shows favor over somebody it is because 
you know he knows the condition of that person you know he has put that person through certain things in their lifetime that has proven to him that they are capable of handling whatever assignment and mission as a light worker that he has placed on their life so when you have that type of power within you my loves and you have the ability you ain't shit like listen to me on some well ass shit baby girls fellas like when you had that type of ability to make an impact you know for the greater good on the planet and whatever kind of way that a logo the universe is guiding you to do it babies yes you be confident you damn sure be confident in what the fuck you doing but you be very humble you know what i'm saying you still display that humility and you still give your father the universe a lot good the most high the lord the holy spirit the praise and you keep that shit in perspective and know that you would not be able to do nothing my mom and papa if it was not for him working his power through you babies and when you keep that type of good mentality when you keep your emotions in check and that kind of way when you keep your spirit at that high vibrational energy and way of thinking that you stay very connected to your mission you know what i'm saying because a lot good the universe is going to continue to fuel his energy within you mama and papa to make you get further and more deeper connected to what you are doing as a light worker but when you take the opposite wow yeah shane and you pick up that boss for that arrogant that ego as oh it's me it's me it's me it's me it's me <laughs> you take that kind of energy baby then you get for the disconnected from your mission baby you get for the disconnected from you know the service of it or and you adapt more of lower vibrational energy so you don't want to do that as a light worker baby understand you're special mama and papa you're very special my loves and you want to keep vibing at the higher vibration and you want to keep ascending higher over time not to say that you're going to be perfect but like we already talked about you know you just do the necessary things my loves to keep working on yourself by the grace of a lord of the universe so that we you can be a more better light worker more and more and more over time because the better that you work on yourself the more that you know you pour into yourself and you work on yourself as the more a lord of the universe will bless you babies to be of that guiding light and of service to others so i love you all so much <laughs> love you all love you all love you all so 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 much please like this video so that way our channel can continue to go comment below my loves let me know are you a light worker mama and papa i would love to know i myself i am a light worker as well so you know i love talking about things like this babies because you know as being a light worker i really want to see all of us yeah you shane keep being on a boss bitch shit a boss do shit when it comes to like you know working more and more and more to help raise the vibration on the planet you know what i'm saying but you know you can't change the world until you change yourself you know what i'm saying and if you have evolved and you have changed my loves to becoming a light worker you want to keep evolving you want to keep changing and you want to like i just said you want to keep ascending you don't want to go backwards you know because you're starting to develop lower vibrational energy or because the most high is blessing you with success as being a light worker hell no i always say motherfucking ten toes what's up what's motherfucking good yeah <laughs> always say ten toes when it comes to your mission you know what i'm saying and as a light worker us being motherfucking ten toes is us displaying that humility 
you know, always giving a praise to a Lord God, the universe, for our accomplishments and for the power that He blesses us to have, so that way we can continue to be of that service to others. You know what I'm saying? Definitely stay confident in your motherfucking self, because I'm gonna tell you, a bitch is confident. <laughs> Well, confident. <laughs> I'm really, really confident, but at the same time, don't get it fucked up, a bitch. Humble this out. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't never get that shit twisted. I know it's because of a logo, the universe, for why I am the way that I am today, for why I have accomplished the things that I have accomplished, for why he has blessed me with the success of different things in my life that I have achieved. It's all because of him, baby. And because I always have that mentality, as a light worker, I never get a fucked up, you know, to thinking that it's only me. No, I know it's him working his power through me, you know. And that's what by his recent permission, I go stronger and I keep becoming a more, better, better, more powerful light worker. So that's how you want to keep thinking, babies. That's the kind of motherfucking time that you want to be on when you are as a light worker. It's not the one being a confident baby. But you want to be humble and you want to always give that respect to your father. You know, so that way you can continue on your mission as a light worker. So subscribe, hit that notification bell so you are updated when I post my next topic. And check out my playlist too, mama, papa. I got a lot of topics in here that you can really benefit from so check them out babies pretty soon i'm going to be having a lot of new series that got introduced to my channel these are going to be new series that you can actually watch not just listen to through the podcast or bash my do if you follow my motherfucking podcast so. <laughs> Girl, fellas, you guys will love the new series you can watch, so stay tuned, babies. And if you haven't done so yet, go ahead and follow your girl or Instagram. My Instagram name is right on that screen, so go ahead and follow me, mama, papa. Because I would love to have you, baby, a part of the Amani Sharifa crew, crew, gang, gang, family, what's up, what's motherfucking good, yeah. <laughs> but until next time my loves peace love and light always Mwah. later